Hello, welcome to How To's. Today we'll be going through a tutorial on how to debug error messages on a WordPress. Enabling WP Debug is very useful if you want to troubleshoot any error messages on WordPress. Okay, first you need to be logged into your cPanel. So to enable the WP Debug, we need to go to File Manager. We need to go to the folder where our website is located. Okay, this will be the root folder for our WordPress. We need to find the wp-config.php. We right click on this file. We click edit. Okay. Once we are in the file, we scroll to bottom. We look for the line uh, define wp underscore debug and we set this from false to true and we save the file. Okay, once we have saved the file, we go back to our website. We just load our website. And there we can see a lot of uh, details instead of the generic error message. This would help us on our process to troubleshoot the error. Alternatively, we can also uh, use the error log which is located on our root. Click reload. We make sure the last modified uh, time of the file is uh, very recent. Right click on it, click view, and we should be able to see uh, the error on our WordPress. So for my case, it seems that the database server on the hosting site uh, is dead. So I need to contact the hosting provider to get the MySQL up and running again. You should be troubleshooting based on the error message that is displayed by uh, WP Debug. Uh, you can also do a Google search on this specific error messages. This will usually give a hint on uh, what problems you are facing. Okay, uh, once you have fixed the problem, don't forget to uh, enable back the WP Debug to false. So I hope this has been informative to help you troubleshoot your WordPress error.